can see from the wonderful surroundings we have, the facilities that are on offer here, not just the, the bedrooms, not just the play areas, but also therapy rooms where we can provide art therapy, music therapy, uh, and, and soft play areas where people can enjoy family time together in a really safe environment. We also provide though end of life care when um, that support that is needed at the end of life can be provided in a setting where the family can stay with the child or the young person and our nursing staff are on hand 24 hours a day to support the family through that, that very sad time. We've been coming around seven and a half years because Molly was born with a rare condition um, where my body attacked her in pregnancy. So um, she had a really late platelet count which affected her, which gave her cerebral palsy, which is a bleed in the brain. We have one-to-one -one care for our daughter, um, which means that we can go and do what we want to do with our son. We can go and do what we want to do together and just chill, knowing that she is 100% looked after, all her needs are met. Amy comes to Demelza so that as a family we can have some respite at home. Amy's got an undiagnosed syndrome um, and she doesn't eat, she's fed through a gastrostomy um, in her belly so she's fed constantly throughout the day so it, it does take up a lot of time at home so it is nice to have that break when she comes here. Hi my name is Chloe, I live in Seacup, I was born in 2000 and I've been coming to the Melsa for a year. When I come here it makes me quite happy because it gets me away from my brothers and sisters. I'm Lucy Hudson and I'm 18. I've been coming here since oof, since I was about 12, I think. Last year, I celebrated my 17th birthday here and I had friends stay over the night, which has never really happened before. Especially not at home, there's just, well, one, there's not space at home, but here, because there's the rooms upstairs as well. Um, they came on my birthday and stayed the night as well. So we sort of partied all night long. <laughs> but it was really good. I, yeah, probably one of the best birthdays I've ever had. I think we've built up a relationship with our families because we are so caring. Um, we do take an interest in not just the children that we're looking after, but other members of the family too. The difference that it's made to Amy's life, I think, is that she's got to know the staff so well here now that it's like a little holiday for her to get away from the noise of her sister at home. What's it like to work here? Well, there's all aspects. It's challenging. Um, no two days are ever the same. What's, you know, the plans of the day change. You have to go with it. You have to be looking for fun, for opportunities for the children and families. I've been here nearly five years and it's like the happiest place I've ever worked in. Uh, from a kitchen point of view, um, it's a bit like a party. Like everyone heads towards the kitchen, so we meet all the families, all the children. If there's any specific stuff that we need to get in, we do buy it in for them so they don't have to worry about buying anything at all. Um, diet wise, it can range from a simple diet such as, um, say, a nut allergy, all the way up to like ketogenic diets where we have to weigh everything out specifically for that child. I hope that the people that we look after um, through the work that we do are able to. Uh, able to fulfil a, a as, as normal and as happy a life as is, as is possible. Working within Demelza and any other form of um, palliative care or bereavement service for children, in, in my experience what I take away is a sense of being incredibly humbled at the end of the day. It's, um, it's a fantastic place to come to for um, fantastic care really. It gives us 100% peace of mind. Being here at Demelza makes me feel more like myself. If I could sum up three words for the males are, they would be good, caring and loving. A family experience. The males are is fun, community and children. Simply great care. Three words to sum up the males and we love you. Our pay for day initiative is to enable us to 
uh, seek to attract more funds into the hospice. So what we're trying to do is to say to people, come along and provide, pay for a day, pay for Demelza to exist for a day, and uh, you'd be associated with that day with your company or your sponsorship, um, and we'd be delighted to, to work with you um, to enable us to continue providing these high standards of care.